sometimes the strategies that are required to gain energy independence are at odds with the strategies required to lower greenhouse emissions. And I'm going to bias my question. So uh, how will you prioritize energy independence versus greenhouse emissions? Uh, will you prioritize our energy independence and our security or uh, give in to this sort of farcical idea that we're killing the planet every day by driving our cars a few miles? I don't think they are contradictory, but obviously our nation's security is our first priority. But one of the best ways to reduce greenhouse gas emissions is to reduce oil consumption, as you know. And so if we could be independent of foreign oil, if we can develop that battery, if we can go back to nuclear power and quickly, if we can d develop uh, clean coal technology, if we can do, uh, look, General Electric, the world's largest corporation, is dedicating themselves to green technologies and they're making huge profits. I don't want anybody to shiver in the dark and it's not gonna be necessary to. We just gotta practice conservation, we gotta go to alternate energies, uh, r resources, and we need to, um, rely on the great genius of American business and entrepreneurship to do that for us. So I think you can, I really believe, my friends, this dependence on foreign oil is a national security problem. And the quicker we reduce that, and the best way to do that is through green technologies which eliminate our, our, our dependence on foreign oil. So I don't think that they are contradictory, but and I'll let you follow up. But some of these measures that are being uh, proposed, which frankly would be harmful to our economy, frankly harmful to entrepreneurship and business, I would reject those. I would rely on the good sense, the judgment, and the entrepreneurship of the American people. These new light bulbs, for example, are a perfect example. They're fine light bulbs and they reduce our energy consumption rather dramatically. I think we can do that in a lot of ways. You want to follow up?